Hello, my name is Derek Franklin, and I'm an Applications Engineer here at Go Engineer. In this quick tip video, I'm going to show you how we can utilize the clone project command inside of SOLIDWORKS Flow Simulation to duplicate a project to a new configuration. This will help if we want to compare results over multiple studies that have the same setup, but maybe a few changes are made in the settings. So this is a quick way to be able to duplicate those projects. So let's get started. I'm going to right click on the existing project here called Zooming A, as this is the study that I want to clone. So I can right click on that study and select clone. Now here I can give the project a new name, so I'm going to call it Zooming B. I can also select which configuration of the model that I want to use. So I can use the current or I can select a new one or I could actually create a new one. I could also copy the results from the copied study if I would like. Uh, but in this case, I'm not going to do that. So I'm just going to hit the green check mark. Now, once you do this, you're going to get a couple of messages. One about changing the computational domain and another about changing the mesh settings. I'm going to click no on both of these messages, especially because I want to compare the results between this study and the initial design. So we want to make sure that the same computational domain and mesh settings are there. Now, after clicking OK, you can see that it's creating the clone study now and I can see that showing over in my tree. So there you have it. A quick and easy way to be able to duplicate a project inside of SOLIDWORKS Flow Simulation, thus eliminating time and allowing us to be able to compare results very easily. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.